हेलो गाइस टुडे आई एम हियर टू टॉक अबाउट मेटा मटेरियल स्टॉक द टिकर सिंबल इज एम एम स्टॉक दिस इज वन ऑफ द रिक्वेस्ट बाय अ व्यूअर ऑन माय चैनल आई एम नॉट इन्वेस्टेड इन दिस स्टॉक बट टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टेक लुक एट द फंडामेंटल ऑफ दिस कंपनी एंड आल्सो टेक अ लुक एट द चार्ट ऑफ द कंपनी एंड जस्ट सी हाउ द कंपनी इज गोइंग डूइंग you know if the worth of a risk in investing in a but anyway guys before we do that why do not just given a nice little like on the channel and subscribe if you enjoy this video but with the said let's start at a meta material already guys so the first i don't really know what a meta material do does so i am going to go right and the profile here and just take a look what they do so it says that the even design development and manufacturing various fun functional material and nano compo composites its product include a medicare and the laser glare protection i wear nano wave or transparent conductive film halo halo optic a holograph op in in save optic element glucose a non inclusive glucose measurement device in metaphor services which allow an enhancement in the signal in the to noise ratio of up to 40 times of magnetic resonance imagine scan the company also also develop and produce nano optical structure and color shifting foil are used in etiquetation and brand protection application in various market including bank notes secure government document in commercial building in a commercial branding as well is is engaged in the research development and manufacturing of small smart material so kind of investment still doesn't really make a ton of sense to me what to do they do i guess id i have seen one of their product but yeah they are tech company basically and it look like they are doing things more like a metaverse space if i had to say and course that goes with a meta material but some of these things seems like their technology that you know like holograph technology that think that it seems like they are going to be the at space so maybe i am wrong sorry i am not but basically i am just take a look at the financial and the chart so the first financial of these organizations so revenue growth of good cost of sale gross profit is pretty good here i would say that it looking a period year pretty good operation expensive pretty good let's see a uh, here net income so look like that have a negative net income so they are their operating expense are weak and high in the comparison of their revenue so the first glance do i like it all yeah nine there are massive unprofitable companies so yeah the revenue growth is new look like okay look pretty good i would say that for from the year to year but in comparison to like their expensive their revenue are their actually their expense are you know 12 to 13 times right their revenue which is not good so all so they have must duplicate do diluting shareholder if we look at the balance sheet we can see how many share have been issued year to year looks like that one pretty normal so how are they how are they paying their bills let's see revenue not really sure they are paying their bill but i guess their cash should have gone down right so if you have take long uh, look as their cash and the equivalent against the cash went up maybe their debit went up and then the well current liability is well up long term debt went to a little bit so that kind of strange why that would be go without oh guesses their capital lease obligation went to lots to this one is interesting one i mean they are common stock equity definitely when lot up lot but they think i am used to seeing for cash to go up aren't really there so even there is strictly cash has gone up turn let's look at quarterly and when we look at back go back to the income statement quarterly by the way yeah looks like a revenue growth is pretty good cost of revenue not bad margin not bad but they and again when we get to the operating expense you just wondering like they what is the hell is the company doing i mean they are operating expenses way more than 
their revenue it is not even close i mean i guess now you can say well it eight times but not good not good for sure looking at that if you will look at the net income from the out continuing and disconnecting operation again still taking up pretty massive loss and i am interested to see if we look at the balance sheet go quarterly did you okay their debt seems to be increasing decreasing here but now it seems to be increasing again in their cash their cash seems i can scroll over a little bit so we have to do 13154140 year then they are seems to bring out their cash pretty quickly and they went through a massive amount of restricted cash in the this quarter last quarter they threw of about half of its yak that not and you can see there too and that the total assets of the organization are going to down if the transfer between categories and they are losing what is about 5% of you about 20 million so you anyway they are burning through cash pretty quickly it seems and just i want to take look at their debt quickly long term debt seems at increasing as well as not a great thing at all you know the basically doubled in the last year which is not a great and if we look at the cash as a we have 630 we don't have their 3430 for some reason or 331 but it look like cash has been cut in half or regular cash or actually more than half rate but the restricted cash is gonna just here here but it come back down at a more reasonable at a high level this we a massive spike here anyway if we, if we look and at the shared issue hopefully they bought back from some share of some time between the six month here and then what they did issue more is share so this is a thousand so 286 million shares so they were issue about 2 million shares so they are, are issuing about 3 million share a quarter is a not horrible because that above that 1% to 2% not horrible but fund their operation but all they are losing money so they can do something to increase their cash all right read another read another free cash flow company with growing negative free cash flow obviously cash flow from continuous operation is negative because they are unprofitable even when they add back to in things in the depreciation yeah that it going to be still in be painful look like that they bought a business not sure what the business that is but there is a quarter for 12 30 actually in the year of 12 31 20, 2021 20, i am going to back look the quarter sorry so uh, yeah i go back yeah their cash flow is still not really improving so it is pretty bad looking at it but i am just interested to see the stock based competition yeah that is increased lot of over the last compared to last 3 or 4 year yes so looking at their cash flow statement definitely not pretty at all so we can also look at their statistics really quick and make sure we are not quarterly this time their market cap has come down and massive amount of its sense since make sense look at their price or to sell so i ended the video if you like the video please subscribe the channel and also press an bell icon for the future update